Y'all see the vibes, man. It's a good Sunday today, you know what I'm saying? Good Sunday. Still got that wig on today. Finally got that wig took off, you know what I'm saying? I guess we itching too bad. Y'all let me know what y'all think. Y'all feel like wigs be itching? Whoever, if, if y'all, you know what I'm saying? Y'all know somebody who wear wigs or y'all wear wigs, y'all let me know. Do it be itching or do y'all feel like, you know, what y'all think? Do a, do a wig look better or natural hair look better? But yeah, man, it's a nice Sunday though, man. You know what I'm saying? Very nice Sunday. Got my V-Touch shirt on. You know what I'm saying? Cause everything got the V-Touch. But yeah, man. Um, I don't know. Today was just going to be, you know, definitely got some nice weather out here. This is looking real nice out there, y'all. But y'all let me know, man. What bike do y'all think is better out of a, um, I'm going to say a 2020. That's the year I'm going to say. I'm going to say a 2020. CRF. CRF 450. Honda CRF 450, Yamaha YZ 450 up, or a, Kaw a Kawasaki KX 450 up. Which bike y'all feel like y'all would prefer to have? Which bike y'all prefer? You know what I'm saying? Y'all leave a comment on that. Let me know what y'all think on that. But, um, yeah, I think that would, we're probably going to go by the shop real quick and crank. Crank. I'm probably going to try the CR, CRF and the YZ. Do y'all tell me which bike y'all think is better? But it's definitely a nice day to do. Very nice day. And y'all let me know, man. What else country? What else country y'all want me to drop? If y'all want a V-Touch shirt too, man, y'all let me know. If y'all want y'all a V-Touch shirt, and let me know what kind of shirt y'all want. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can go check out the, um, you know, the link in, in the description or whatever for that V merch. Cause everything got the V-Touch. <laughs> Definitely a nice Sunday. And hey, y'all let me know what y'all like doing on Sundays too, man. What y'all what y'all like doing on Sundays? You know what I'm saying? What do y'all how do y'all spend y'all y'all days off, man, from work? You know what I'm saying? How do y'all spend y'all 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 Saturdays, y'all weekends off, or you know, those two days that y'all got off from y'all job? I gotta try. I gotta um try jet skiing again too. Yeah, I'm not gonna. I got. I got to do. I gotta try jet skiing again. Do y'all feel like jet skiing is fun? What y'all feel like fun? Jet skiing or uh, riding bikes? Jet skiing or uh, uh, dirt uh, riding bikes? Uh, four wheelers. What y'all think? The bike life or jet ski life? Y'all let me know what y'all think on that, man. Jet ski life or bike life? That's a good question. That's more of like jet ski is more like more like the water life. And bikes is more of like, you know. I wonder can you wheelie a jet ski? Y'all think you can wheelie a jet ski? Like lift a jet ski up 12 o'clock a jet ski? That'd be crazy. I gotta try it though. Y'all let me know what y'all think on jet skiing, man. Do y'all feel like jet skiing is fun? How, how would it be? Is it, is it the same thing as riding a bike, jet skiing? Or is it a different? I know it's a different because of course you, you're around a lot of water and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you fall in that water, you, you, you gonna sink if you, you know what I'm saying? You gotta... Man, you you gonna sink with the sharks or whatever down there, sharks, alligators, or whatever. What y'all feel like is worse? Y'all feel like it's, it's worse being attacked by a shark or worse being attacked by an alligator? That's another question I got for y'all. Is it worse worse being attacked by a shark or an alligator? Uh, you, you know, y'all y'all gotta choose one though. Y'all gotta choose one. Y'all can't choose both. Y'all gotta choose one. Quote me on that. What's the worst thing you would hate to have to tell somebody about this? Like, what, what what's the worst thing you hate to, like? No, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm getting the question messed up. What is the... Dang, bro, I forgot. That. It's like, what is the worst thing you would... Yeah, what's the worst thing you'll, you'll, you'll have to tell somebody? Like, what's the worst thing you... Like, about they self. Like, about they self. What's the worst thing you'll, you'll tell somebody? Like, what's the worst thing... What's your fear? Like, what's your damn dog? I can, it's it's a quest. I forgot the question a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. That's why it's confusing. It's like a lot of people don't like to hear about themselves. They wouldn't like it in general. So, the worst thing you would hate to have to tell somebody is about themselves. I'm not gonna lie. The worst thing I, I hate to tell somebody y'all is um is that they have stink breath or something like that. A uh, bad hygiene. And I'm not gonna lie. When I used to work at the warehouse, y'all. When I used to work at the warehouse, it was a guy, bro. This man, bro, the man smelled like funky every day. And you know, I'm not the type of person that'll tell somebody that. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to tell somebody, like, yeah, bro, you smell stink or nothing. And he was cool, too. You know what I'm saying? He wasn't like he was no no mean person like that. He was a very cool person, bro. 
he was very cool. It was just that his body odor was like horrible, bro. Like, like it, it was horrible. But I, I never told himself. I, I mean, I never told him, you know, about his hygiene or nothing like that. That's my worst fear, y'all. My worst fear is telling somebody that they have bad breath or that they have a bad odor to themselves, which is that they like musky or funky or something like that. You know what I'm saying? That's my worst fear. And like I say, man, men's, men's guys talk every day, man. When, when I used to work at the warehouse, at the, um, it was a forklift. <laughs> it was a forklift job. I used to work at a, for, a tire a tire warehouse, man, on the forklift, putting the tires up. And that was the job where the guy used to smell like real, like funky, bro. Like his body odor was like, bro, it, it was, it was. If you, if I got, if I got to quote him from a one to ten, one being the worst, no, one being the best. Like, that mean a good smell, and ten being the worst, which is the, um, the worst smell. I had to quote him at a 20. I'm not gonna lie. It's like he'll burn your, your nose hairs off, bro, if you smell this guy. But, you know, I just talk to him every day, bro. I just talk to him every day. But I never once told him that he that he smelled stink, bro. It, it took for somebody else to tell him. And it's like when they when they finally told him that he was smelling like a little, you know, under the weather or whatever, it's like he thought it was a joke. He was laughing with him. He was like, <laughs> like it's like he was laughing, bro. He thought they were joking with him. But they, they was dead serious because I was serious, but I never told him. So I knew he smelled, but. I don't think he he knew how serious it was himself. Y'all let me know. Y'all y'all ever had somebody y'all work with, bro, that smelled like musky or they breath smelled um, bad or stink or something like that? Uh, did y'all ever have to tell somebody that they breath would stink or tell you know somebody that they smelled bad? Y'all let me know what y'all worst feel that y'all what y'all would have to tell somebody. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, man, we almost there, man. Look at this guy drinking a like he drinking a um a smoothie or something driving. He might, might be drinking an energy drink. But yeah, man. When we get when we get there, man, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna tap back in with y'all, but y'all already know the vibes, man. What's good, y'all? Y'all know the vibes, man. I got I got all the 450s out, you know what I'm saying? I just wanna pull them out because I haven't started the bikes in a minute. Um this the 2019 KS 450, the 2020 CRL 450 off, and the 2020 YZ 450. So we're gonna be starting all the bikes up. Cause I haven't um, started the bikes in a minute. Tires up too. Might have to pump the tires up. Tide went flat for sale. That's how you know when you haven't been riding your bike in a minute. When the, when the tires go flat, just from sitting. Cause I know I haven't went up with no nails in that, so I'm gonna have to pump the tires up real quick, y'all. We're gonna pump the tires up. How do you know when it stopped? That thing was all the way flat, y'all. Let's see. Oh, that's crazy. That's crazy. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that.
install the front side and use F. All my tires went flat. I'm just sitting. Y'all, now I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna try to push start this on um, the 2019 because my battery, my battery died. Yeah, he's trying to start over, but that's crazy, man. The battery went dead on this, man. I hope I can push start. Let's see. Crazy. I guess the push start's not gonna work on here. Whew. I don't know how the damn battery went dead. That's crazy that with electric starts you can't even push start it, push start the bike. So it's like the electric start gotta work, dog. You'll get stranded. Hmm. Yeah, the battery definitely dead, though. I don't know what y'all think I should do. I might try to, um... I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try to take the seat off here, y'all. I'm gonna take the seat off this bike. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna use the jump cable to jump it with, with, with that bike. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm, I'm gonna jump it, y'all. I'm gonna jump, I'm gonna try to jump start it. This is team. All right, y'all, so I'm gonna take the seat off real quick. I'm gonna try to jump it real quick. All right, as y'all can see, I got the seats off the bike, y'all. I'm gonna, I hope this worked though. I'm gonna try to jump the KX with the, with the CR. Yeah, this is how you jump a bike, y'all. Cause as y'all can see, the battery, the battery is dead on the KX. The battery is definitely dead, it's not doing nothing. Feel me? That's from sitting. Yeah, the battery is dead. I'm hitting the button, the battery dead. And this one, the battery is charged. So I'm gonna see if I can jump. I'm gonna jump the KX with the CR real quick. See what happened, y'all. Y'all see what happened? We're gonna see if this works. I don't know how to get it up in there. This is my first time jumping a bike, not a bike. Should work though. Y'all let me know if y'all ever tried this before. Y'all let me know if y'all ever tried this before, dog. Yeah, this battery, it's about time for me to get a new battery though, y'all.
want so y'all can see how they sound and run. Y'all just need to come in and let me know what y'all think. y'all i jump started a bike jump started my bike with the other bike that's why it's, it's good to at least have two electric starts just in case this happens but i'm um i'm gonna end up getting me a new battery though y'all that battery that battery is, is is a limit the battery is old y'all but yeah it still it still works uh oh i think it slipped out yep slipped out a little bit yeah y'all gotta be careful man not to drop any screws anything to y'all bikes that y'all have out there. But yeah, man, sounds good. Not though. Make sure that seat nice and tight. You don't want the seat to come out while you dancing in the seat or, you know, doing your thing. Not gonna stand why the battery went dead on this bike though, y'all, cause I, I don't even ride this bike, you know what I'm saying? I haven't rode this bike in like a long time. if your battery dead and you know that's what you know we just seen that is they will not push start and start up if your battery is dead you have to use the electric start to work for your bike to crank up with these electric start bikes and that's why you got to make sure you know the bike can't sit too long like i like i just made the mistake of sitting months almost a year without starting as y'all see what just happened tires go flat and you have to charge your battery um i mean tires go flat and your battery go dead but yeah y'all put this tool up real quick i'm gonna give y'all a, a run and let y'all know but i'm gonna come right back man but I'm gonna give y'all um, a quick test ride so y'all let me know what, what, what bike y'all like the most. But y'all know the vibe. 
We're gonna start with the kids since it's been sitting a long time. I'm gonna start with the kids. I'm gonna let y'all hear how it run. Um, and y'all let me know. It's like y'all like the most.
me know what y'all think, man. Y'all prefer the YZ 450, CRF 450, or the KS 450. I just showed y'all how each one of these bikes run. So y'all let me know what y'all think on them. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy the battery went dead, though, y'all. That's why, you know. Like, comment, subscribe. Y'all leave a comment. Let me know what y'all think, man. What did, did y'all battery ever go dead on um on y'all bikes on y'all electric starts? Uh, let me know which one y'all like the most: CR, KX, or the YZ450. Um, if y'all let me know if y'all got the same bike, what kind of year y'all got? You know, in the comments, or whatever. Um, you know what I'm saying. But y'all have any questions? Y'all just let me know, man. What else? What else content y'all want me to drop for y'all? You know what I'm saying? Y'all let me know. And um, y'all know I read all the comments like I always say. But other than that, man, y'all already know the vibes, man. We gonna, um, we gonna wrap it up for now, but we gonna, um, you know, like I always say, we gonna go from there. Look who pulled up. Yeah, oh, you still got it, boy? There we go. Oh, man, you still got the bike, huh? Okay, yeah, them boys, you know, just came through, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we outside, man. We this boy, I'll wait, man, for real, boy. This is so you rookie of the year, man. Every day we outside. Rookie of the year here, boy. He still ain't doing nothing on that. He just looking good. Oh. You just look good on it. Man, yo, use no, it man. for the... Hey, Jay, tell him use it what it's for. No, tell out, Jay. It ain't for that. Is, it ain't... It's not for looking cute. Hey, hey nah. Hey, hey, hey Jay. Hey. Hey, yeah, you outside. Ain't gonna lie. He just got the reverse. He just looking good out here, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, it, that's what's up, though. Yeah, but still got the 23, though. Y'all see the vibes, though, man. Yes, yeah, he didn't put all the packs on his too, though. Last and that boy got four bottles of oil, boy. Yeah, he hanging out good. Just washed up and all. <laughs> now nah, she look good though. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't never seen her that clean. Now nah, she looking good though, bro. Yeah, she looking good. I ain't gonna lie. Damn, boy. Oh, I put the seat on back right. Yeah, you know, yeah. Knocked it down and made that bit tight. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah, that's what I was feeling for. If it's still like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, that's the fan on your bike. Yeah. That thing look good though. That's nice, bro. That'd be like a camera. That's it, bro. What's that? Cool it. You need to cool it for that? Mm-hmm. Why you need to cool it? You just got the bike, bro. It's low, fam. You know, brown moist, bro. They cheap, man. Look at this man, bro. Put that shit like halfway. Bro, this man just got the bike, what, a week ago? Nah, like a month, like three weeks ago. It ain't a month already, bro. Yeah. That's been like a week, bro. Nah. Do y'all feel like his bike around the cooling that quick? 23, wrapped right 700? You gonna ask the people. You gonna see every time he asks me something crazy, I'ma ask the people, man. Do y'all feel like he's back around a coolant, coolant that quick? He got it two weeks ago, y'all. But yeah, y'all see the vibes though, man. I'm boy pulled up real quick. You know, yeah, Sunday, Pretty Sunday. But y'all know the vibes, man. Look at the weather. That's just good outside, bro. Mm-hmm. Nah, I ain't get it though. I ain't get it. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I ain't get it. I ain't get it. We good. I ain't get it. But them boys finish get up out of here, man. 2023 game. First hit. Like out of the um the 2023 Raptor or that Banty, you know what I'm saying? Cause you know they don't make Banties no more, y'all. So y'all let me know which one y'all like more. Y'all prefer to have a Banty, that Banty two stroke life, or you know the Raptor 2023? Y'all leave a comment on that. Let me know what y'all think on that. But them boys just came through real quick, you know what I'm saying? And put on a little show. But y'all already know the vibes, man. The V Touch. Y'all let me know what y'all think though, man. What y'all think about you know another day with V? You know what I'm saying? But yeah, my battery ended up being dead on the. 2019 KX 450 from sitting like I was saying you never want your bike to sit sit that long especially if you got electric start see the kickstart you don't too much got to worry about it because you know you just kick started well but with a straight electric start you know the batteries that's the only bad thing about having an electric start 
the battery will go dead. Even though it's more convenient because you literally just hit the button and go, but you know what I'm saying? You don't have to kick it or whatever, especially if you you got a lemon, you just hit the button. And you know, the bike will crank up or whatever, but y'all let me know what y'all think on that, man. How long do y'all feel like a, I'm gonna say electric star bike will have to sit until the battery go dead? Y'all feel like it'll go dead after a month, two months, three months? Five months, eight months, y'all let me know what y'all think on that. But I definitely know my battery was dead. But that's crazy though, because that's the only battery that was um dead out of the rest of them. That's the crazy thing. That's what I don't understand. Y'all let me know what which um which bike which brand y'all like the most the, the um yeah the most. Out of the KX, the YZ, or the CR. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, that definitely was a day with V, you know what I'm saying? I walked y'all through again. But this time I walked out through after my bike's been sitting for a minute. That's the crazy part. And I, I think that was the last bike I, I tried to start too. That was the last bike I tried to start and the battery was dead. Yeah, I, I thought it was something else. What's going on up here? Something going on up here, y'all. Something definitely going on up here. Got the fire, fire truck up there. Yeah, the fire truck. I don't know what's going on. Is it cut off? Or... Yeah. Just about to take another route. So I'm definitely going to go this way. Crash or something. Yeah, I just go around. So what's going on? That's crazy. Yeah, y'all, y'all let me know y'all um y'all take on it though. How y'all feel about KTMs too? You see a lot of people be saying I don't got a KTM, that's the only like back I don't have a KTM. And it's a Suzuki a RMZ 450. Y'all let me know what y'all think on those two too. Yeah, that's pretty much it, man. And that's crazy. I jumped, I jumped, I jumped the KX, y'all using using the other bike, the CR, the CRF 450. Y'all let me know, have y'all ever tried that too? Have y'all ever tried to jump, jump one of y'all bikes using another bike? And if if y'all did try, did it, did it work for y'all? Y'all let me know, y'all take on that too. You know what I'm saying? Let me know what y'all think on that. That was wild, bro. I, I, I jumped it with jumper cables, another bike with another bike. But after I jumped it though, the battery seemed like it was pretty, it was pretty good after that, y'all. Yeah, the battery was pretty good after that. It actually kept working, it's actually on, um, Kept starting up, but I'm gonna have to try it tomorrow again to see how how it um how it is. If the battery will go back dead, or is it gonna um is it gonna start right back up? It's gonna be perfect. But I gotta start um starting the bikes up more often though, y'all. Like especially the electric starts. I think oh you know that's not a good um good feeling. I need my bikes to start up at every time, every time, all time. And even the tires were flat. The front tires, I'm saying. The front tires went flat for saying, y'all. That's crazy. That's crazy, bro. I'm not gonna lie. But yeah, man. Y'all know the vibes, man. You know what I'm saying? If I missed on anything that y'all wanted me to talk about, y'all leave a comment and let me know. You know what I'm saying? Let me know what I missed, what I missed on, what I missed out on. But other than that, man, y'all already know the vibes, man. The feet touch, you know what I'm saying? Safety first, get it in gear cycles. But other than that, y'all already know the vibe, we're gonna go for now.